Hello everyone! When you are driving at 70 miles per hour, what is the most important thing? In this video, we will explore extremely serious incidents that began with just a few seconds of distraction. A blue car was turning into an intersection when it suddenly and inexplicably stopped right in the middle of the intersection. This unexpected stop left a moto coming from the opposite direction, traveling at about 60 miles per hour with insufficient time to react. The front of the car and the moto appeared to be completely damaged. Both people on the moto took four months to recover. Making decisive driving decisions and carefully observing before turning can ensure safety for yourself and others. So always be proactive and focused while driving. A Hyundai sedan recklessly overtook a container truck. The excessive speed caused the car to lose control and crash into an oncoming truck. Do you often overtake in this manner? Hopefully, this video will help you realize that this way of driving is extremely dangerous. Distraction caused the man driving the SUV to suddenly rush forward and hit a sedan that was waiting for workers to clean the grass. The speed was about 40 mph, p, causing both cars to be almost completely damaged. Luckily, everyone is fine. The video was shared by Canal when he was waiting at a red light near Fairmont Park in Salt Lake City. A suspect driving a white sedan was fleeing from police pursuit because he had just committed a previous crime. He ran the red light at too fast a speed, knocking the SUV in front of Canal. Luckily, Canal was not injured, but both the suspect and the poor driver were taken to the hospital in critical condition. Darling was on the way to his office in Louisville, Texas, when he saw a truck suddenly changing lanes, unaware of a sedan driving next to him. The sedan was completely damaged, and the woman was taken to the hospital immediately. This is one of the main reasons to pass trailers and not drive next to them for longer than necessary. When driving on the highway at 70 miles per hour, nothing is more important than looking ahead and staying focused. The video was shared by Derioka when he and his 86-year-old grandmother were returning home after shopping on the Queen Elizabeth Way Highway. A BMW sped up from behind at about 80 miles per hour. The speed was so fast that everyone present was very surprised. Luckily, people didn't encounter any problems. An incident occurred in Los Angeles when a black BMW tried to squeeze between two cars moving in the same direction at about 60 miles per hour and lost control. This caused three cars to be completely damaged due to the sudden situation. Luckily, airbags were deployed and everyone was safe. The incident happened when the braking system of this SUV had an issue while the driver was moving on the highway. The speed was too fast combined with the slippery road, causing the pickup truck to be thrown away and crash into an SUV in front. Perhaps after watching this video, you should think about your next regular vehicle checkup. You won't know what's waiting for you right behind a big bus as you accelerate and overtake. So please consider and observe carefully before making a safe decision. Another incident occurred on the highway in Los Angeles. When the Ford suddenly changed lanes to the right, when he realized his lane was too crowded, it was worth mentioning that he stopped immediately, causing the incident to occur. After the accident, the driver of the Ford hired a lawyer and claimed that the Ram was at fault. However, after the Ram car's dash cam was released, the driver of the Ford admitted his mistake. Who do you think was at fault in this situation? Comment 1 if you think the SUV was at fault. Comment 2 if you think the sedan was at fault. It's never been a good idea to make a U-turn in the middle of an intersection, even if your lane is on a green light. The SUV's action caused the SUV behind it to crash and flip over. It took six months for the two people in the car to recover due to his wrong actions. 
Many incidents result from a few seconds of distraction. Have you ever made this mistake? Share your story in the comments. If this man had asked himself why everyone was stopping and answered that question, this would not have happened to him. Just before you attempt to split lanes, you must make sure there is no car coming at you from behind. It is not natural that our protective equipment such as body armor, gloves and helmets were born to serve us when sitting on our motorbikes. All of them have some reason to be on this earth. Do you agree with me that maybe there should be an IQ requirement on the driver's license test? Controlling your speed is always a good way to ensure you get home safely. This is why there are more lessons about distraction every day. Hope you always have safe trips. Early on the morning of May 7th in Plant City, Florida, a driver suspected of using stimulants fled from the police at a speed of 100 miles per hour. The speed was so high that when he tried to change direction, he lost control and crashed into the side of a church. According to the report, a breath test later revealed that he had consumed too much alcohol before driving. He was later released on $8,500 bail. Sometimes taking a shortcut might be faster, but it can also quickly lead to trouble. Hopefully, you'll always consider this when trying to overtake. Despite everyone waiting at the intersection, this sedan brazenly sped through. With the speed at 60 kilometers per h, the truck driver had no choice but to witness a collision. Fortunately, everyone was okay, but the driver of the other vehicle paid a high price as his car was completely wrecked. Perhaps this is the reason you have to proactively slow down when approaching an intersection. Even when the road is deserted, something bad is probably coming your way. A drunk driver behaved very dangerously and recklessly in a stolen car. This man decided to flee from the police patrol. The police could only apprehend him after he caused a severe incident that left his car unable to move. The incident occurred in Texas when a man driving a sedan ran a red light, even though it had been red for quite a while. A speed of about 70 km h made the collision more serious. The white SUV was knocked away and continued to crash into another car that was waiting at the light before coming to a stop. The man driving the sedan tried to go a few seconds faster, but he put others in danger and got himself into trouble. Even if the light is green, you cannot move safely. This is why you should always observe carefully when approaching an intersection. The incident occurred between the pickup truck and the man driving the sedan right in the middle of the intersection. The man was in his 80s and claimed he was just trying to make a right turn, but this video exposed his actions. The incident occurred when a pickup truck was waiting for its turn to turn around, causing the sedan to have limited visibility, so it turned into the moving lane regardless. The collision at a speed of 60 mmHp caused the sedan to be thrown in the middle of the intersection. Luckily, everyone was okay, but the sedan was completely damaged. Traffic clearly slowed down as the road became so crowded, but the Mercedes didn't realize it because of the driver's distraction. This video shows us the importance of concentration while driving. The incident occurred in Los Angeles, California, 
when a sedan ran a red light and tried to cross the intersection, colliding with an oncoming SUV. The impact was quite strong and caused the SUV to flip sideways immediately afterward. Luckily, the airbags deployed, keeping everyone safe. Always keep a pair of sunglasses in your car, because without them, this might happen to you when driving against the sun. The incident occurred in Emeryville, California. While Alan was driving on the interstate, a Toyota Camry suddenly swerved into the fast lane to avoid hitting the car in front that was showing signs of stopping. However, the speed was too fast, causing the driver to lose control and crash into the roadside guardrail before coming to a stop. This is why you must stay highly focused every moment on the road when driving at high speed. Three car collisions occurred at Greenway Loop and Cave Creek Road in Phoenix right in front of Jack while he was waiting at a red light. Who do you think is at fault in this situation? Please leave your comments below in the comments section. Three cars were seriously damaged. When a Honda turned left, it was hit by a Corvette that was not approaching at high speed because it did not want to miss the yellow light. The impact was so strong that the Honda was thrown away and continued to hit the SUV waiting at the red light. Luckily, the bag, once functional, kept everyone safe. When merging lanes, always observe carefully and ensure no vehicle is rushing towards you. This will help you stay safer and even save time. This white SUV deliberately went into a priority lane without noticing the car in front stopping, resulting in him changing lanes too late and crashing into the stationary car. The front of his car was severely damaged after the strong collision, but fortunately, the airbags deployed, keeping everyone safe. The accident occurred in South Cincinnati, Ohio. The Toyota driver failed to notice that the cars in front were not moving, resulting in a collision that caused severe damage to two cars, fortunately with only minor injuries to everyone involved. Philip was traveling near the Sonoma Ranch when a GMC came from behind, crossed the slope and crashed into the Tacoma in front of him. Maybe he lost control of his car. After a sudden panic, the two cars were seriously damaged and he was unconscious and was taken away by ambulance. Hope he's still okay. The SUV driver changed lanes abruptly at high speed, not realizing that the road ahead was uneven, causing him to speed over it. This made the car launch into the air and land, then spin around to the horror of the passengers inside. Everyone was safe after a moment of extreme panic due to his reckless driving. The incident occurred on I-66 in Virginia when the driver of Ben's car forgot that his trunk had not been closed. Traveling at 60 miles per hour, the truck overturned. Luckily, the driver was able to escape in time. The incident occurred when the Hyundai attempted to cross the intersection, despite everyone else stopping. Immediately, a sedan sped towards it, striking the Hyundai and causing it to flip over. Fortunately, everyone got out of the car safely. This is why we must always stop and observe carefully when approaching intersections. Even though the red light has passed for a long time, but the driver of the Honda still tried to jump up and hit the oncoming SUV. The impact was strong, causing both vehicles to be propelled forward. The airbags did not deploy, but fortunately, everyone was okay.
his dojo or something. Driving fast might get you home quicker, but it can also lead you into trouble. So hopefully, you'll choose to stop when you reach a red light. The loss of concentration caused the Camaro to suddenly change lanes while traveling on the highway, dragging two other cars into the incident. Traffic was starting to slow down, but the SUV didn't notice, leading to a collision. When the SUV's speed was about 60 mmHp, both cars were almost completely damaged. Luckily, everyone is fine. The habit of changing lanes without looking and not using turn signals led this woman into an accident with two other cars. Please share your safe lane changing tips below for everyone to learn from. You can't be safe if you try to speed up on a heavily rainy and slippery road. A horrific accident occurred, the car suddenly lost control and plunged from the bridge. The strong collision caused debris from the car to scatter and the car's body was severely damaged. Arnie was traveling on the highway when he encountered a van stopped on the side of the bridge with their hazards oh on God. and the driver of the white CRV who seems to have been distracted slammed into the back of the van. The pickup truck behind the van also wasn't paying much attention and slammed into the CRV. Then the car behind the camera car got hit by the white CRV. Neither driver hit the brakes until the last second. An incident occurred in Irvine, California, when a driver, distracted by their phone, ran a red light while people were moving, resulting in a strong collision. The Mazda lost control and crashed into a light pole before stopping. Fortunately, the airbags deployed, resulting in only minor injuries to those involved. Some people ignore very important road signs and end up learning very costly lessons. Hopefully we all follow traffic laws and stay calm while driving. Always stay alert and focused while driving. If you feel tired, stop and rest. This will help keep you and everyone else safe. When you are traveling on the highway at 70 match P, what is important? William was on the way home during work hours when he saw the man driving the sedan too engrossed in arguing with his wife. So he lost concentration and suddenly crossed into the opposite lane on a curve. The speed was so fast that a collision was inevitable. Luckily, the driver's attempt to steer to the right gave his whole family a lifelong lesson. Let's continue with another lesson about distraction. The incident occurred when the sedan driver fell asleep in his car. As a result, he never woke up to continue his journey. Hopefully this teaches us all the importance of staying focused while driving. If you feel tired, stop instead of trying to push through. Regularly checking your vehicle not only keeps you safe, but also affects those around you. Two tires escape from the trailer of a truck, then both wheels hit the first car in front, then the second car filming. Luckily, no one was injured in the incident. A heavy fuel tanker tries to overtake the trucks in front for a long stretch of continuous road. And just when his thoughts were about to come true, a serious incident occurred when a sedan was approaching at a speed of about 50 mmHp. Luckily, the sedan driver was still able to continue his next journey, but it still took him two months to fully recover. Fast speed may get you home sooner, but it can also get you into trouble. So consider carefully before you speed up. There is no one who can't have their own lessons, even if you are a police officer. 
A few seconds of distraction caused the police officer to crash into a sedan that had just merged into the highway lane. The speed was so fast that both cars crashed into a ditch and the police car overturned. Luckily, everyone is safe. Mike was on his way back to Indiana when a sedan suddenly cut in front of him at 60 miles per hour. The speed was too fast, causing the car to hit the rear of a Mazda before veering off the road. Luckily, thanks to Mike's efforts to pull the brakes, the woman in the sedan and everyone remained safe. The incident occurred on East Essex Avenue when a black pickup truck failed to notice a white car making a U-turn. Traveling at a fairly high speed, the black car swerved and veered across the road. At that moment, a sedan arrived, too close and fast, causing both vehicles to crash into each other. The collision was quite severe, heavily damaging both vehicles. Both drivers and passengers were taken to the hospital. Sweaty was waiting at a red light when he saw a driver trying to run the red light and cause an accident. Although the light had been red for quite some time, the white car still tried to cross. Sweaty observed this and honked to warn the SUV, but it was to no avail. The crash was so strong that both vehicles went flying and continued to hit a nearby light pole. The white car even crashed onto a concrete platform and bystanders immediately came to help and took them to the hospital. The pickup truck wanted to change lanes as traffic slowed down, but the brown Honda did not notice this. The Honda collides with the tire of the pickup truck, pushing the pickup into the back of the trailer of the semi, and the Honda gets airborne and flips upside down. Fortunately, everyone was okay. This is probably the clearest video about instant justice on the road. This is why you keep looking in all directions, even when the light is green or you have the right of way. JT, while traveling on the highway, suddenly a speeding drunk driver crashed into the back of a pickup truck. The impact was quite strong, causing the car to lose control and hit the roadside railing. The guy in the SUV was charged with DUI reckless driving and taken to the hospital. Yo, holy shit. Some witnesses said the two cars merging were in some sort of road rage situation on another road before this happened. The driver of the gray car was arrested, so he may have been drinking, was going 70 miles per hour when this happened. This is why you have to maintain a safe enough distance, because by maintaining a safe distance, you have enough time to deal with everything. The driver of this Civic abruptly braked upon noticing another car changing lanes forcing Marcus Lai's car to also brake hard to avoid a collision. However, the Kia behind was not so lucky. The collision was minor and did not result in any injuries. This video will explain why you need to focus on driving when moving on the road, especially on busy streets. Oh, I saw that coming. Damn. The incident occurred in the Urbana area of Frederick, Maryland. A black car attempted to beat a yellow light while a Hyundai was turning left, resulting in a strong collision that flipped the Hyundai. People immediately rushed to help the woman escape from the overturned vehicle. The fire department responded to the accident and arrived 10 minutes after it happened. Fortunately, she was only shaken by the event and did not sustain serious injuries. The incident occurred at the intersection of Vasco Road and Camino Diablo, 
When a sedan unexpectedly made a U-turn at the intersection, and the pickup truck behind it crashed into it. The speed was too high and the distance too short, making the crash severe. Fortunately, no one was seriously injured. The 14-year-old driver had no insurance and no driver's license. A truck with expired license plates and registration crashed head-on into dark after losing control on a corner, hitting a light pole, and heading straight into his lane. All three people in Dark's car were taken to the hospital, one with internal bleeding, another with a broken toe. The child driver received multiple tickets, along with juvenile charges. The parents will also have to bear the costs. However, the parents claim the car was stolen. The incident occurred at Pinellas Park. The SUV tried to run the red light and crashed into a pickup truck, flipping it over due to the strong impact. Hopefully, everyone is okay. Cran was waiting at a red light in Champaign-Urbana when suddenly a vehicle ran the red light and crashed into his car. It turned out that the driver was a pirate, pursued by the police. He faced four traffic violations and four other charges related to his theft activities. No one was injured in the accident, but he hit a total of four cars. A sedan suddenly jumped into the lane, causing another Honda car which was traveling at a high speed to not have enough time to react, creating an extremely serious incident. The driver of the Honda took 15 months to recover. Hopefully this video will be a vivid example of observing carefully before merging into the lane. A serious incident happened on the highway when people were driving against the sunlight and lost concentration, leading to an overreaction. This is why you should prepare sunglasses so that when you go against the sun, you will be the proactive one. The incident occurred in July 2022 in Radcliffe, Kentucky. When a gray SUV was fleeing from the police, it unexpectedly collided with an oncoming pickup truck. The impact was quite strong, causing both vehicles to be thrown and injuring several people, including the woman who recorded this video. It took her 22 months to recover from the accident. This video serves as a vivid reminder that we must observe carefully when approaching intersections, especially when the road is empty. The incident occurred in California when the Mercedes accelerated and changed lanes suddenly on the highway while a man was changing the tire of the SUV in a previous incident and was almost hit. The speed was too fast and the distance was too close leaving the Mercedes without enough time to handle the sudden situation, so it only had time to avoid colliding with the man, but the SUV was pulled away and overturned. A truck suddenly stopped in the middle of the highway, leaving the truck in front of Alexander without enough time to react, so the driver steered to the left. At the same time, a truck on the opposite side was also approaching, the impact was so strong that the driver in the truck on the opposite side was thrown out of the vehicle. He was even extremely surprised by what happened. This video is a prime example of how dangerous distraction can be. The serious incident caused at least three vehicles to be seriously damaged. It took the three drivers many months to recover. Just because a few seconds of the sedan's distraction caused the incident to not happen according to anyone's plan. Hopefully this video will help us learn an important lesson about concentration while driving. An SUV suddenly sped up and passed at the same time the sedan was changing lanes, which was extremely surprising. The speed was too fast, causing the sedan to lose control and crash into the guardrail. The impact caused the car to be thrown into the air and spin before coming to a stop. It took three people in the car 15 months to recover, 
This is why you always need to stay focused and pay close attention when driving. A very serious accident occurred on Ring Road 2 in San Pedro Sula. The incident occurred when the driver of a heavy tractor driving at high speed lost control and collided head-on with two buses and several small vehicles. The crash injured many people, and some even lost their lives. Hopefully this video will serve as a lesson for all of us not to abuse speed, drive recklessly, and maintain our vehicles regularly. This video will explain why you need to think carefully before overtaking on the highway. Both cars were severely damaged when the grey car overtook recklessly and couldn't get back to its lane in time. The incident caused three people involved to take 20 months to recover their health. Speed can get you home sooner, but it can also get you into trouble. Hopefully, we all make wise choices to drive safely. The man driving the sedan attempted to overtake in heavy rain and slippery conditions, causing him to lose control right in front of a truck. The strong impact completely wrecked the sedan. The sedan driver was taken to the hospital immediately afterward, and it took him 22 months to fully recover. In slippery conditions, think carefully before you accelerate. The incident occurred when the man driving the motorbike suddenly accelerated and swerved into the lane of another moving motorbike. He immediately regretted his actions when the speed was too fast, causing both fallen cars to be towed away. 